round, he was explaining to Max Kaiser <clears throat> that this whole game is up, right? That they have now, after seven years, turned around their interest rates. I mean, they hiked the rates, basically. Oh, it's symbolic, it's a quarter point. And it's meaningless. And then Kaiser asked me more or less what it's all about. Well, anyway, I'm paraphrasing Hegel. It's like Hegel basically said, well, it's nothing, it's just... Uh, smoke and mirrors. They don't know what they're doing. The country is that they have no policy. The Federal Reserve has no policy. I'd go further and say they don't even have a strategy. They seem to have no clue and they know that they are behind the eight ball and cornered and according to Aegon and in part according to astrology, we knew we had this discuss this in May, remember, that um, there would be this um, rate hike change. But it isn't really a change, it's just that now after seven years the game of cheap money is over. But it's possible that after half a year they may have to actually backtrack. Because they're doing it, although all the fundamentals are actually against this move, but they have nowhere else to go. So Egon was saying what he told us before, about half a year ago, he said they have no policy, no strategy, and eventually the game will be up. That was fun. He, he did a good presentation with Kaiser. And Kaiser listen for him for what change. It's too complex to explain. I think that in 2020 there has to be a complete reset. How these four years, 16, 17, 18, 19, are going to be spent, I don't know exactly. I think that they will be confronted by, let's say, surprises, things they have not planned. He already said they have no strategy, no policy. Their planning is, um, is non-existent, but they are going to have to deal with events that they themselves cannot control. And that's hard to say, I would imagine. In the later part of 2016, and then gradually all the way to 2020, 2021, the strong moment astrologically is February, March 2020. Let's say solstice 2020, when the sun is at Aries 1, everything else is piled up in Capricorn, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Pluto. And at that point, we clearly see from the astrology that the energies of the whole world are going to change. Something new is going to begin after an ending of sorts has happened. So what I'm trying to say to people with Egon too is that the whole thing is a pro process, right? It's a work in progress. All these guys are saying the crash, the crash, tomorrow, next week, the crash that they were saying in September and October, we're now in 2016. There was no crash as such, but there is a gradual, progressive um, disintegration of all of the reality around the economy. So what I'm saying is it's a process and it may take four years or five years still. And really, actually, the process is in progress since um, 2001, right? 2008, 10, 12, Q. So the whole thing is a long um, mechanism. It's almost an organic process of disintegration. These things don't happen overnight. Of course, they're trying to manipulate things, such as gold, the markets, and everything. And by these manipulations, they have a semblance of holding it together. And actually, they're just delaying the inevitable. That's all. But it's going to happen. How? I don't know. But I would say in four or five years, it will be in a completely different um, economic situation, in a completely different surrounding of what's the energy will have changed. When you go from these planetary islands we now to a whole Capricorn set up into Aquarius, that's almost as if the entire psychological climate of the planet will change, but in which that too is a process, so it doesn't happen overnight. But I think around March 2020, some extremely unusual things will transpire, politically, geopolitics, with Putin, um, and Putin has done a really good job so far, it's been very calm, and the Russians are doing what we predicted in our book, they are gradually putting the place back in balance. But anyway, so I'm saying in the next four or five years, it's when it's happening. However, gradually, 
and stuff will happen in 2017 or 19. And so on the, by 2020, I see the change as a past tense. Yeah, so. <laughs> She's